the Philippines. The Philippines. 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 So first on oil and gas development. Deep beneath the blue waters of the West Philippine Sea lies one of the country's greatest treasures, natural gas. And now, the Philippines is entering a bold new chapter. Malampaya Phase 4. This is not just another energy project, it's a mission to secure the country's future, strengthen its energy independence, and protect millions of Filipinos from the darkness of power shortages. But to understand why phase for matters so much, we need to go back to where it all began. In the early 1990s, the Philippines was almost fully dependent on imported oil. Power blackouts were a common nightmare, especially in Luzon. Then, in 2001, something revolutionary happened. The Malampaya Deep Water Gas to Power Project was launched. Hidden 80 kilometers off the coast of Palawan, engineers discovered a vast reservoir of natural gas buried 3,000 meters below the sea floor. That discovery changed everything. For over two decades, Malampaya has powered 20% of Luzon's electricity, keeping homes lit, factories running, and cities alive. But now, that once abundant gas field is starting to decline. Experts warned that without expansion, Malampaya could run dry by the end of the decade. That's where Phase 4 comes in a massive effort to find new gas pockets, upgrade aging platforms, and extend the life of this energy lifeline. Phase 4 is not just a technical project, it's a national mission. Engineers are drilling deeper than ever before, using cutting-edge subsea technology to reach and tap reserves buried far below the seabed. These drilling rigs are like floating cities self-contained, high-tech hubs that operate 24 hours a day in some of the harshest marine environments on Earth. Every valve, every pipeline, every control system must work flawlessly because one mistake could cost millions or even lives. What makes Phase for truly inspiring is that it's led by Filipinos. Local engineers, technicians, and geologists are taking charge, proving that the Philippines doesn't need to depend entirely on foreign hands to develop world-class energy projects. New wells are being drilled several kilometers beneath the ocean floor, connected by a vast network of subsea pipelines that stretch all the way to onshore processing plants in Batangas. There, the gas is cleaned, compressed, and fed into power stations that generate electricity for millions of homes. Each phase of this operation demands extreme precision. The drilling rigs must withstand fierce ocean currents, typhoons, and pressure levels hundreds of times greater than those on the surface. Yet despite all these challenges, progress continues at a remarkable pace. The team is combining innovation and experience to make sure that Phase 4 doesn't just extend Malampaya's life, but improves its efficiency, safety, and output. One of the key goals is sustainability. Unlike coal or oil, natural gas burns cleaner and emits fewer greenhouse gases. By expanding Malampaya, the Philippines can reduce its dependence on imported fuel, cut down carbon emissions, and by time to transition into more renewable energy sources in the future. It's a bridge to a greener tomorrow, powered by the country's own resources. The economic impact of Phase 4 is also massive. Every new well drilled means jobs for Filipinos engineers, welders, vessel crews, logistics workers, and contractors. The project also generates billions in taxes, royalties, and investments that flow directly back into the economy. But perhaps the greatest value of Malampaya Phase 4 cannot be measured in pesos or dollars. It's about national pride about proving that a developing nation can master one of the most difficult feats of modern engineering and do it on its own terms. Still, there are challenges ahead. As global energy prices fluctuate and environmental pressures grow stronger, the Philippines must balance energy security with sustainability. That's why Malampaya's operators are also studying ways to integrate new technologies like carbon capture and hydrogen blending, ensuring the field remains viable in a changing world. The race against time is on. Every day, the demand for electricity rises, and every year the reserves decline. Phase 4 isn't just an expansion, it's a fight to keep the lights on for future generations. 
Behind every pipe laid and every well drilled are the hopes of millions of Filipinos counting on Malampaya to power their homes, schools, and dreams. The success of Phase 4 will determine whether the Philippines continues to stand strong on its own energy or once again becomes dependent on costly imports. From the first spark of discovery to the roaring engines of drilling ships in the open sea, the Malampaya story is one of resilience, innovation, and national unity. Phase 4 is not the end, it's the beginning of a new era where the Philippines takes charge of its energy destiny. Deep under the waves, the engines hum, the drills spin, and the future of an entire nation continues to flow powered by Malampaya.